Hello boys and girls from grade 5. Welcome to episode 3 from unit 3, weather and climate. This is Nofil Gatlan and today I'll present to you the grammar. Today we will learn about conjunctions. Conjunctions are mainly used to join different words or sentences together. Conjunctions are mainly used to join different words or sentences. Or, usually used to join negative sentences. The conjunction or is used to join negative sentences. All right, boys and girls, this is how we use the conjunction or. She isn't good at running or swimming. She isn't good at running or swimming. It means that she is not good at running and she is not good at swimming. I use the verb is plus the negative form not, isn't and the conjunction or and then the rest of my sentence. So I combine those two sentences together. She isn't good at running or swimming. What is our rule? Sentence one in negative form plus the conjunction or plus sentence two in negative form. The rule again for the conjunction or sentence one in negative form plus the conjunction or plus sentence two in negative form. Let's see a few examples. Sentence one in negative plus Sentence two, in negative. I don't like pasta. I don't like salad. So I have here sentence one, I don't like pasta. And I have sentence two, in negative form, I don't like salad. And I would like to join them together using a conjunction. I use here the conjunction or. I don't like pasta or salad. Excellent, boys and girls. I don't like pasta or salad. Now, can you use examples of conjunction or? Let's go for another example. Sentence one in negative. Sentence two in negative. The first sentence, she doesn't have brothers. She doesn't have brothers. It means like she doesn't have any brothers. Sentence two in negative, she doesn't have sisters. It means that she doesn't have neither brothers or sisters. And I would like to use the conjunction or to make a correct sentence. She doesn't have brothers or sisters. She doesn't have brothers or sisters. It means that she doesn't have brothers and she doesn't have sisters. So to make our sentence short and neat, we use the conjunction or. She doesn't have brothers or sisters. Another example. Sentence one in negative. Tigers can't fly. Tigers can't fly. Plus, sentence two in negative. Tigers can't swim. So here I have tigers can't fly and tigers can't swim. And both sentences are in negative form. And I would like to join them using the conjunction or. What should I do? Tigers can't fly or swim. Excellent boys and girls. Tigers can't fly or swim. All right, boys and girls, we have the conjunction so plus consequence. So, usually used to introduce clause of result or decision. The conjunction so, it was a long journey, so I'm very tired. You have to ask yourselves here, why I am tired? Because of the long journey. So, as a result of this long journey, I am very tired. It was a long journey, this is my first sentence, and then the conjunction so, and then the consequence, I'm very tired. 
What is our rule here? The sentence one plus the conjunction so plus the sentence two, which is the consequence. Let's see a few examples here. It's very cold, so I will put on my jacket. Why I'm going to put on my jacket? Because it is very cold. It's very cold, so I will put on my jacket. Another example, boys and girls. I don't have money, so I can't buy a car. I don't have money, so I can't buy a car. Why I can't buy a car? As a result that I don't have enough money. Again, I don't have money, so I can't buy a car. Another example, boys and girls. It's mom's birthday, so I will buy her a present. It's mom's birthday, so I will buy her a present. Now, why are you going to buy a present for your mom? Because it's mom's birthday. It's mom's birthday, so I will buy her a present. All right, boys and girls, can you use the conjunction so in examples as such? Sure you can. Now, let's have some practice together. Join the sentences with the conjunctions so or. It's very hot. I will go to the beach. It's very hot. I will go to the beach. What do you think, boys and girls? I'm going to give you a minute. Excellent. It's very hot. So, I will go to the beach. Why I'm going to the beach? Because it is very hot. That is why I use the conjunction so. She didn't travel to Paris. She didn't travel to Dubai. She didn't travel to Paris. She didn't travel to Dubai. Excellent, boys and girls. She didn't travel to Paris or Dubai. Here I have two sentences joined together in negative form using the conjunction or. She didn't travel to Paris or Dubai. Another example. She studies hard. She will get high marks. She studies hard. She will get high marks. Excellent. She studies hard. So, she will get high marks. So, ask yourselves why she's going to get high marks as a result because she's going to study hard. She studies hard. So, she will get high marks. Now, let's practice boys and girls together. Choose the correct answer. Today is Friday. The weather is cloudy. But, so, or, we won't go to the sea. We will stay at home watching a movie. So, but, or, playing video games. It's a weekend, so, or, but, we will enjoy our time. I'm going to read this again for you, boys and girls. Try to focus and try to think which is the correct conjunctions to be used in this sentence. Today is Friday. The weather is cloudy, but, so, or, we won't go to the sea. You have to think, boys and girls. Which is the correct conjunction? We will stay at home watching a movie. So, but, or playing video games. It's a weekend. So, or, but we will enjoy our time. Let's check our answers together. Today is Friday. The weather is cloudy, so we won't go to the sea. Why we won't go to the sea? Because the weather is cloudy. That is why we use the conjunction so. We will stay at home watching a movie or playing video games. So here I have two options. 
we will stay at home watching a movie or playing video games. It's a weekend, so we will enjoy our time. Excellent, boys and girls. Our answers are so or so again. I'm going to read the paragraph for you with the correct answers only. Today is Friday. The weather is cloudy, so we won't go to the sea. We will stay at home watching a movie or playing video games. It's a weekend, so we will enjoy our time. Excellent choices, boys and girls. All right, boys and girls. Go to your pupil's book, page 42, and choose the correct conjunctions on the email. This is your homework. Dear Yasmin, I'm glad to hear that you're enjoying your time in Kuwait these days. It is very cold and snowy here in Canada. Last Monday, when I was driving back home, it started to snow heavily. I couldn't see the street or the cars around me. You have to find out, boys and girls, the correct answers. All right, boys and girls, we have reached the end of today's episode and we have learned how to use the conjunctions or and so. Thank you for watching us for today and we hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you one more time. Goodbye.